right, so our next uh, portion found in our workbook is Applying Yourself to the Field Ministry. We have to thank everyone who is taking part in the treasure section as well. On our first student assignment, the initial call, uh, will be given to us by Winter Libsman, and she'll be assisted by Madison Murray. So let's invite our sisters up. Hey Madison, I know I still have a little down today. Is everything okay? Hey Winter, well I lost my grandma over the weekend, so it has been rough, but I know she's with God now. I'm so sorry to hear that, Madison, but do you really think that's what God purposed for us was? I mean, what else can I think? I just, it just seems that at this point, I've lost so many people, I just think that's the way life was meant to be. Well, let me share with you what God's word says regarding this in Genesis chapter 1, verses 27-28. And God went on to create the man in his image. In God's image, he created him. Male and female, he created them. Further, God blessed them, and God said to them, Notice this here, Madison. Be fruitful and become many. Fill the earth and subdue it. And have in subjection the fish of the sea and the fine creatures of the heavens and every living creature that is moving on the earth. So what do you think God's purpose really was? To become fruitful and become many and fill the earth and subdue it. Yes, Madison. So, how does that make you feel? To be honest, I never really knew that, and I feel much better now. I'm happy to hear that. Well, it looks like class is about to start, but let me ask you one more question that I can answer at lunch tomorrow. Why can't we trust that God will fulfill his purpose? Okay, sounds good, Winter. Thanks. 